Hey guys, it's Mansell here, and today I'm going to be taking a look at the beautiful Nifra Denial from the Boo York line, and I picked her up from Toots Toys, and again I'll leave a link to the website in the description down below. Before we get on with the review, don't forget to check out my review on the Wheel and Wear Cats, which is just new out, and I'll leave a link to that video at the end. Ok so we'll start on the top left hand corner, and it says soundtrack available. Just under that we have the Monster High logo, and it also says Monster High. And on the opposite side we have a high rise building, and it says Boo York Boo York, a monsterific musical. And in the upper right hand corner we have the Boo York musical, coming out on Blu-ray, DVD and Digital HD later in 2015. Going up the right hand side of the box we have the street lamp, and these little street signs, and one says Nefra Denial, Daughter of the Mummy, and the other one says City Schemes, and in the bottom right hand corner we have some artwork of Nefra, and this doll has also been recommended for ages 6 and up. On the back of the box it says, as the night of the comet approaches, Nefra scares up a terrible scheme and uses its powers to entomb Caddy's voice forever. Just below that we have the Boo York City landscape at night, and we also see the little comet there in the background. And at the bottom of the box it says the monsters take a musical bite out of the city, when Cleo is invited to attend a fancy gala celebrating the return of the magical comet, she brings her best friends along, but it's not all fun and fright scene, when Nefra uses the comet's powers in a diabolical plot against Caddy, can the monsters and her new city girlfriends unwrap the mystery of the comet in time to help her? And you can also visit the Monster High website and download her vacation diary. Ok so that was a look at the packaging, I'm going to go ahead now and remove that, and we can check out Nefra up close. Here is Nefra out of the box, and if you missed out on the first wave Nefra, this is a great opportunity to pick her up. Right so let's get started and check her out. And we'll start off by taking a look at Nefra's hair, which is really long and goes right past her waist. It's all done in one length, and it's done in a beautiful turquoise colour. And it also has a few blonde and black streaks through it, as well as this metallic copper colour done in tinsel. And here is a look at her hair from the back. And from the other side. She's also wearing a black headpiece with crystal designs on it, and it has two snakes on the front facing away from each other. We'll now check out her features, she has a light bronze skin, which has a shimmery effect to it. She also has black eyebrows, purple eyes, and these beautiful eyelashes which curl around. Her makeup is also really pretty, she's wearing turquoise and a metallic gold eyeshadow, and this dark red lipstick. She also has this little star design under her left eye, and this gold tattoo on her left arm. Her earrings are really cool, they're little snakes wrapped around a crystal, and they're done in gold. And check out her dress guys, it's so beautiful, it's done in an iridescent blue, and it has these green snake patterns over the top. At the front there where it looks like it appears to be a black tie, it actually splits into two at the top and converts into the shoulder straps. And I'll just give you a view of that from the back. And her breastplate just easily clips over the top of her dress. And again just loving all the detail on this, and it has a little snake at the bottom which curls all the way up to the top, and it also has these crystal designs fanned out on the left shoulder. She's also wearing matching fingerless gloves which are done in a turquoise, and they have these bandage designs on them, now these are part of her arms and not removable. Now 
Moving down to her shoes, which are done in a translucent green, they have these really cool straps going up her legs, or are actually little snakes? And check out the heels, they're actually crystals. And I'll just give you a view of those from the side. And here is a look at them from the back. Nefra also comes with a few extra things, and I think this is part of the comet, and it's done in purple and it's in a pyramid shape. It's also hollow on the inside. And I'll just give you a view of that up close. She also comes with a silver doll brush in the shape of a scullied, and it has these crystal designs on it. And the last thing that comes included is this grey doll stand with a silver base. And it has Monster High embossed on it, as well as some more crystal designs. Okay guys, that comes the end of my review for Nefra Denial from the Boo York line, and it's nice to see Nefra re-released in a new line. And let me know in the comments below if you're going to be getting her, and until next time, thank you again for watching, love you guys, and I look forward to seeing you, same place, same time, tomorrow.